Good morning guys, it is a Wednesday morning and I'm currently at the train station on the way to go to Melbourne to see Connor Rogers and his mate Matt. Uh, Matt helped us film the 5 on 5 uh, clearance footy game that me and my mates played against Connor's mates, which will be on the channel soon. <laughs> But today's the first day we're going to start cutting it and um, yeah, can't wait to see uh, hopefully the start of uh, you know one of the most exciting videos I'll be bringing out this year because I can't wait to show you guys, it was so much fun. I am so tired guys, um, had about three hours sleep before I worked the 11 hour day on Saturday and then I made the stupid decision to go out with Mitter, which was fun but I don't know, it was just so unnecessary and then I didn't get much sleep for that and then I just I've had like six or seven hours sleep since I haven't got that full recharge so just struggling a little bit on the hump day but we'll be all right getting in the grind <coughs> start editing the footy video Matt is the channel 7 type producer and Connor I'm the supporter I was in the hamper. <laughs> uh, lateral thinking puzzles just because I'm scared that the producers here are thinking too straight. I wanted to get a bit more lateral, um, a bit like Geelong Football Club's ball movement. A couple of tidy rigs flying around here as well. <laughs> McDonald is uh, he's not getting the shirt off. I can tell you something for nothing. <laughs> yeah, nice guys from Street. <coughs> now editing can get a little bit tiresome, but there's nothing like having a little bit of a jam to break up the monotony of editing. So we're just gonna make up a song on the spot. Uncle Doug loves a dart. Uncle Doug loves a beer. Uncle Doug's really insecure. He's got a lot of fears. On Christmas time he thinks that he is a center of attention. But I call the cops and next Christmas he's gonna be in a penitentiary. Cheer up Uncle Doug. Cheer up Uncle Doug. Have this commemorative mug. Doesn't matter that your body looks like a bowl of glug Cheer up Uncle Doug, here's your mug Here is your mug, here is your mug, here is your mug Uncle Doug, leave me be Why do you have to go around touching me? Can't you see, can't you see This is gonna hurt me for life Never gonna talk to my wife no. Scared and I'm gonna cut it with a knife no. So just had our first crack at editing the footy match and went it, went, down, it went pretty well. Went down a tree. Pretty, um, pretty productive day. We're not quite there yet, but you know, it's it a, a great first session. There's a couple of uh, cheeky transitions and stuff that make it look pretty professional. Matt, oh, yeah. Matt's pretty top notch on the old editing, isn't he? Yeah, well, um, our video producer Matt really knows what he's doing, so shit, thank you Matt. Anyway, I'm heading back to Geelong and I've got indoor soccer tonight. How do you reckon I'll go? Um, are you the kid that gets put in goalkeeper because he can't do anything else or are you playing out field? I think I'll be out in the field, but I might have I might get thrown the gloves at some point in the day, but that's alright. I'll back you into um I'll kick two. I'll back you in for three. So the video went up, uh, the golf footy challenge. I feel personally I could have edited that a little bit better. There was times where, um, I don't know, yeah, there was just a, a few little mistakes that I left in there which I was pretty frustrated with, but I just rushed myself so much. I was doing other things during the week, but it wasn't like I couldn't do it. Um, it was just one of those things where I left it real late, and then, yeah, I got to work like 10 minutes late because I was trying to get the video up. Um, so I just rushed myself, but I'd happily do footy golf again. It was good fun. Off to Ed Sheeran today. So, let's go. With the boys that were off to Ed Sheeran. Oh, he's vlogging, is he? I'm on my way. Driving to Melbourne. For a Sheeran. And but a chicken. And but a chicken. This reminds me of Gold Coast noon where we had to stop on the side of the road a couple of times. Nah, I'm out of it. The car's fully fixed now. It's gonna be hard to get back on the Harry no! Highway. No chance. It's gonna be hard getting back uh, on with the well, cars, bigger fast. Just... Get this on safely. Oh, no. oh, You're gonna have to like accelerate fully and then just. Yeah, after this car. Oh, 
Is there anything wrong with three blokes going to Ed Sheeran? No. <laughs> no. It's like there's nothing wrong with four guys going to see the Dune Rats. That's a great call. Who's got three? He's got three! He's got three! He's got three! Got all the boys on the butter oh chicken train. Oh my god. Oh. One of the better butter chickens. Kahol going a bit Harry Met Sally here on us, but. Oh. What did she have? I'll oh, fucking have it. Thank you very much. <laughs> put, oh. it, put it in reverse. <laughs> Not a big food court oh, operator, but this butter chicken, absolute yeah. treat. We're on our way to the big Etihad Stadium, and it's just pitch a perfect night, Dunners, isn't it? Oh, mate, it's like the Gold Coast. I'm it is like the Gold Coast. Coast. Goal, how are you travelling, mate? Mate, I'm on, on my way, way. Driving, driving down. down. We're causing an absolute scene, but. It is as good as it gets in Melbourne on a Friday night. Pitch a perfect, not a cloud in sight. We're going to rip the lid off Ed Sheeran. Number 10. Nah, honestly, this is picturesque. Look at this thing. It's here, mate. It couldn't be any more perfect. This is romantic. It's romantic. Yeah, you take your first date on here. That's for sure. Oh, mate, I take my third date. We're on the half forward flank and we're just waiting for the Sheeran man. The big Edward. Yeah, the Yo, my brother. We've got our Ed Sheeran looking to pull forth tonight down the uh, Lloyd End. Yeah, the Lloyd End. Sheeran, he'll be presenting hard, working hard for his kicks. Where is Ed? Where is Ed? <laughs> that ain't Ed. That's not Ed. <laughs> Where is he? Are you with me, Melbourne? Can you be louder than Perth and Adelaide? The one thing we can take in our stride, lads, is that Ed Sheeran waved at us. He gave us a wave. He gave us a wave. He gave wave. us a wave. It wasn't to anyone else, it was to us. I'm not sure if it's on footage, but he waved at us. He waved to us. We'll take that. We'll take that for the rest of our We'll take that to our graves. It's now a Saturday at Arvo, and I'm just about to go to Melbourne to see Dutchie with Austin Cookson again. I'm here with my brother from the same mother. If you put this on, I'm gonna fucking kill you. Well, that's going in, big fella. <laughs> Uh, we just watched all the clips from Ed Sheeran. I think I had a few too many lemonades. <laughs> just one. Just one or two. <laughs> oh, well, you live and you learn. Um, Cook, I'll be here any moment to pick me up and I'll get out of your hair. I don't have any hair. Yeah, there's not much, <laughs> not much of it, is it? <laughs> Oh, 
just a couple of modern day dads. <laughs> modern love. Just getting the face up for our little son. <laughs> Who's watching cartoons at the moment. <laughs> oh. Chop, 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 chop. We don't know what we're doing here, but... Oh, looking good. <laughs> looking good. Some sizzling going on. Plenty of sizzle. So Ed Sheeran was last night. This is just a bit of a Saturday night cook up in Melbourne with LVG in Austin. And then back down the Harry Highway to sink bevies with every man and their dog tomorrow. So it should be good. And to top it all off, the brisket has risen. Definitely didn't come from the pack. <laughs> Absolutely treating. Liam, ah! you're an idiot. <laughs> oh dear me, wow, we are funny. in trouble. Oh, dessert. Why does that taste a little bit? On a petite. Oh, it's good. Get it while it's hot. The same? That is good. It's just needed to be okay. I'm gonna get a plate. <laughs> <laughs> now we've saved it. We've saved it off the floor. And it's going down a tree. This is the shittest vlog of all time. Oh, that's not a bad call no, though, is like it? Just, it just is. Like. There were these um, professors and oh, students, yeah, and they're always their classes. <laughs> oh, great vibes, great classic hits. The bartender baker, pouring one of the finest body raspberries you'd ever see. Oh, that's a bit. That's a bit. Yeah, that's, not big. that's a bit stiff. <laughs> Yeah, this peak, the 10. I'm going the 10. <laughs> He's given up. He's given up with his third ball. Oh, the boys are in all sorts of the pills. Delicate. Oh, dearie me. Dearie me. He's just hard. Yeah, he bounced him. That mole was a bit tight on that one. He just bounced him. Watch him in again. Watch him in again. Oh! 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 oh. <laughs> How did that happen? He's coming back. That was Tina. Oh, going for the perfect game today. Perfect game didn't last very long. Baker's sending them flattery. Oh, we are in trouble. <laughs> Chasing 140. I needed the spare to put him away. I couldn't get it done. Come of the moment, come of the champion. Oh, that won't be enough. Oh, dearie, we are in trouble. Oh, no. So, a strike will do it. <laughs> oh no! Oh, he's oh no! <laughs> I was mentally weak there. I was mentally fragile. That has been another week, guys. I appreciate everyone watching. Um, I'm really enjoying these weekly vlogs. I'm going to try and keep pumping them out. I'm trying to rein it back so I can get them out on Sundays. 
But at the moment, I'm sort of just off kilter a little bit, and they're coming out on Tuesdays. But, um, yeah, footy season is back next week. Well, not this weekend coming, but next week. So, um, obviously, plenty more AFL content. Um, yeah, really excited by a few videos that are coming out. Obviously, the footy game will be out, not this week, but the week after, in the lead-up to round one. And, um, yeah, I really appreciate the support. And um, I appreciate everyone who watches and everyone who shares the videos and tells your mates about them. It's, um, you know, it doesn't go unnoticed. And um, I'll speak to you soon.